Welcome Libra. This is Renee and welcome back. This is your next 48 hour reading and I've already um, shuffled the cards and dealt the cards to save time so the video doesn't run very long. If this reading resonates, like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, make sure to take a look at your other signs. They could be resonating with you more at this time. Okay? So let's get into it. Okay, Libra, in the first row, your near past energy, we have new love, the Four of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Ten of Swords. So let's take a look. Okay, we have new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. You know, so you could be encountering some kind of new interaction, some kind of new love that's coming in. If you haven't experienced this yet, this could be coming in for you very soon. Um, for your energies. Okay, we have the Four of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. So I really feel like your finances, you're very focused on your finances right now. And I feel like you're trying to balance things out. You do have abundance here that's coming in. There's some kind of new beginning that's coming forward for you. Some kind of new offer or new money. This could also be a offer for a new job is what I'm getting. Or it could be a promotion. Um... I feel like with this Ten of Swords being right underneath this Ace of Pentacles, I feel like something's ending for you. It could be the ending of something that you were worried about. I know you could be worried about your finances, um, but I feel like, you know, the Four of Pentacles, this is balancing out. This is also maybe a need to be focused on where you're putting your money away at. But it can also mean longevity too. So this could mean that some kind of money that you've been hoping for um, or some kind of job or career that you've been hoping for is going to bring you long-term stability because this is, this is stability coming in. This is being more stable, right? So I feel like whatever is making you unstable is ending, okay? So that's really good news for you, Libra. Your, your, your money is working out for you. This is money, abundance, good health, good family. You know, that's the pinnacles, the material wealth. You know, things from the earth, worldly things, okay? We also have, in the present energy, exchanging gifts, the number 27. The number 27 could be very significant for you. It could be your birthday, your age. Um, also the number 2, the number 7, and the number 9. Okay, those are what I'm getting. But I feel like there's some kind of gifts being exchanged here. Right? There's some kind of news coming in. I feel like this is news that you've been waiting for. This is some kind of good news that you've been hoping for that I feel like you know you have a lot of stability here a lot of things are being balanced there's a lot of things that are becoming equal you know you may have been upside down with your finances for a while you may have been lacking I feel like your finances are improving and you may be moving on to relocate for a job or career this may be some kind of move that you're making you may be moving from one job to another one house to another you know one destination to another but i feel like in some way shape or form you're moving right libra and i, I feel like you know it there's a lot of happy energy here right um i don't see anything bad so that's that's really good. I feel like your next 48 hours is going to be very uplifting, right? And Libra, we have compassion for your near future. Archangel Zadkiel, soften your heart with respect to your situation and all the people involved, including yourself. 
okay so whatever situation you find yourself in Libra I feel like you need to be light-hearted with yourself and others you know have compassion you know see past the issue and um, maybe even find some kind of compromise right um, but I feel like that compassion card there's a situation that you're going to have within the next 48 hours that someone really needs you to listen. They don't need you to react, but they just need you to listen. They need some kind of shoulder to lean on. So I feel like that's very significant for some of you, right? Okay, with this Page of Cups, I feel like there's something new coming in. There's some kind of offer coming in that you're really going to love. This could also be new love coming in after a time of being alone. Um, a time of soul searching. A time of discovering new things about yourself. Right? Having a new focus. But I feel like there's some kind of new energy coming in for you. There's something that's going to be a blessing to you it's something that you've been waiting for you've had a lot of patience for but it's also something that's going to bring you balance and like I said this is a blessing it may be a blessing in disguise you know um, I don't feel like it would be very apparent right up front but I feel like if this is a person I feel like this is a person that's going to make you very happy someone who's very caring very kind someone who's very patient who is not quick to react to certain situations right and so i feel like you may be finding yourself in a new situation that is just i'm getting very hopeful Okay? And I don't feel like you're raising the bar very high when it comes to new love coming in. I feel like you're kind of at that point where, you know, you know exactly what you want. You know exactly what you need. But you are focused on the person, not the material they have. Hmm. Let's clarify these cards. Let's get some clarity. Okay. Give me a message for Libra. Next 48 hours, please. Message for Libra. Message for Libra. For the Four of Pentacles, we have the world. Yeah, big changes. You've been through some kind of cycle. This is a new cycle that you're starting. So definitely, if this has to do with your finances, this is on the right road. You know, you're on the right path. Because I feel like, you know, one path is ending, but you have a new cycle that's beginning. We also have new money here, right? So and I feel like this puts you in a very good position. I feel like there's a lot of improvement. There's a lot going on for you in the next 48 hours. Tell me about this Ace of Pentacles, please. The Ace of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles. Look at this. Beautiful. There's a lot of stability coming from whatever the situation is. There's a lot of stability. This may be someone coming in to offer you something very, very good. Right? Um... <laughs> yeah, this is stability. Tell me about this Ten of Swords spirit. Give me a message for the Ten of Swords. We have Temperance again. Look, bottom row. Temperance, Temperance. So this is definitely a blessing. Okay? This is definitely something that you've been waiting for. A blessing in disguise. Um, big blessings, big blessings, double confirmation, the blessings are on the way, you know, your angels have spoken, right, 
So, the Page of Wands. Message for the Page of Wands, please. The Moon. Yes, yeah, something that you've been waiting for. There's some kind of news, some kind of information that you've been waiting for. That's going to be revealed to you. Um, so hang tight, Libra. Okay. For the Six of Pentacles. Clarify the Six of Pentacles, please. The Tower. Big changes. Big changes, right? So look at this. The tower isn't always a bad thing because you have to think about it. Whatever is ending, whatever had crumbled, whatever is changing, it wasn't stable. You know, it wasn't going to bring you any success, right? Because it wasn't able to flourish. It wasn't complete. It has to crumble. So they, there's some kind of stability after this change, right? There, there's some kind of feeling of being equal, of being brought back together after some kind of tower moment. Okay, tell me about this Knight of Wands. Tell me about this Knight of Wands. Why do I feel like Libra is traveling? Tell me about this, please. The Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Yeah. You're coming into some kind of money. You may be traveling to accept this money. Um, you're traveling to... Um, I really feel like it's for a job. Some kind of promotion. You could be traveling to work at another establishment. Work at another place. Tell me about this Page of Cups energy for Libra. But this is this is really good. Your pentacles are looking really good, Libra. Okay? For the Page of Cups, we have the Three of Cups. So I feel like you're out, you're being really social. You may have the need to be around friends, be around people. Or if you haven't been out in a while, Libra, it's time to get out. I feel like that's where you may receive this offer. Um, someone may approach you with some kind of offer to go out on a date or, you know, you may meet someone new, but I feel like, you know, it's a time to get out and enjoy yourself. Have fun. Okay. With the hermit card, tell me about the hermit. The knight of wands. Look at this. Yeah, you're definitely going somewhere. I feel like you may have been alone for a while or you've been soul searching. You've been making plans um, maybe to take a trip, go on some kind of adventure, right? But I feel like this energy, look, we have the uh, Knight of Wands, the Page of Pentacles, the Hermit, and the Knight of Wands, right? So although, you know, the Wands they're coming before the hermit on this side. I feel like, you know, you are in a better position over here than you are over here, right? You're in a better position now. You know exactly what you want. You know exactly where you want to go, right? So I, I feel like what you're doing is you gain the wisdom. You gain the knowledge. You know that you don't have to be alone. You know? So I feel like whatever you're soul searching about, whatever you're thinking about doing, you're going to take action. This is inspired action. You know, this is movement. Very enthusiastic movement. movement. So this isn't something that's frustrated or hurried. This is something that you know, you're taking intelligent action towards something that you've been soul searching about, right? Tell me about this temperance card. The King of Swords. Okay. I feel like with this temperance card, 
I'm not sure why I'm feeling this, but I feel like someone has spoken kind of sharp to you. You know, someone has said something to you and you're like kind of brushing it off. You're trying to get past it. You're trying to find the you're you're trying to find your balance after this king has said something. Tell me more about this king. Tell me more about this king, please. The Two of Cups. Yeah, it could be someone that you're in a relationship with. It could be some kind of conflict that you just went through. I feel like whatever this is, the storm is over. It's done with. Um, but I feel like, you know, you're, you're, you're still kind of in this rebuilding phase. You could be rebuilding your um, emotions. I feel like your ego was kind of hurt in the situation because this king was so sharp with you. They were blunt, right? And I feel like you're you're in this like building your back yourself back up. Yeah. You're building yourself back up. We go from the King of Swords, Two of Cups, the Seven of Pentacles in reverse to the lovers. Right? So I feel like whatever this is, I feel like you're trying to forgive someone for something that they said that was really sharp, really blunt, really cut like a knife, right? Um, hmm. Give me an outcome, please. The Six of Pentacles again. The Seven of Swords and the Ace of Wands. Okay. Yeah, you're trying to gain your balance, Libra. Although this person hurt you, you feel like they weren't very honest, they weren't very truthful, and they kind of has taken so much, right? But you're not going to let them take that anymore. You're like starting fresh. You're starting over. I'm not saying that you're leaving this person because I'm not sure if you're leaving this person or not. Um, if this is a person that you're already in a relationship with. But I feel like there's there's new beginnings. There's new actions being taken. Um, yeah, look at this. The Three of Swords in reverse. So there's some things that you're holding on to. There's some things that you haven't quite healed from yet. Um, but I feel like there's this new beginning. The Page of Pentacles. There may be another offer on the table. I feel like this person is doing a lot of apologizing, right? This person is trying to come to you and apologize for something that, that, that they said. That may be where this exchanging gifts is from. Because I, I feel like this person who hurt your feelings is trying to show you how much they care by buying you something. By buying you a gift, right? We have the Three of Pentacles in reverse. I'm not sure if you're going to accept it. I feel like your heart is like, it, it, it's still going through healing. So I'm not sure if you're going to accept it. Uh, we do have the Hierophant on the bottom. So this could be someone that you're married to, someone that you're connected to. Um, but I feel like there's some place where you're trying to seek some kind of counsel. Right. Um, very interesting. Let's get some angel cards. See what's going on for some advice for Libra. Yeah, we have the cloak of wisdom. You already know the answers you seek. Trust what you know. Right. So there's something that may have been revealed to you or you already know the answers. You know, we see that you hear about something that you needed to be exposed. Something is being exposed and revealed to you and you're receiving that word. Right. So there's some kind of knowledge that you're receiving. But I feel like you may already know the answer in the situation. So, I mean, if you're looking for counsel or advice 
I feel like you're just trying to confirm what it is that you already know yourself. Right? Okay, we have divine healing. Honor your sensitivity and retreat to recharge and heal. Your light can support others. Okay? Beautiful. At the bottom we have awakening presence. The universe is with you. Wear a cloak of protection and love. Okay, so you are being protected. You may not see it or you may not feel it surrounding you, but you are being protected, Libra. Okay, let's get your angel number before we close out this reading. Let's get your angel number. Okay, we have 1616, willpower. Things may feel out of sync and not within your control. The whisper of the divine is asking that you remember that you are being supported and that you will, that your will is your superpower. Determination is the key right now. Your affirmation, I call on my strength and my willpower to take the lead. I accept and listen to the support of the divine within me. Okay, so that is your message, Libra. So, Libra, I hope this message helps you. If this message resonates, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. They be, can be resonating with you more at this time. And until your next reading, Libra, my beauties, love, and beautiful light.